I want to take this opportunity to address the issue of Jomo Kenyatta International Airport, where the allegations that Jomo Kenyatta International Airport is being sold by one President Ruto. I want to advise President Ruto that it is very unwise to sell Jomo Kenyatta International Airport to Adani Group. And I want to warn Mr. Adani that should you try to procure or to purchase Jomo Kenyatta International Airport, which is a public asset belonging to members of this country, we are warning you strongly, should you try, we are going to rebel with a lot of force and you will not get it easy, you will never be at peace. As the area member of parliament for Jomo Kenyatta International Airport, this is an asset that is giving this nation money in form of revenue and to a tune of billions of shillings annually. And therefore, Jomo Kenyatta International Airport is also providing jobs to the members of Embakasi East constituency, Nairobians and Kenyans. I want to urge and request all the workers at Jomo Kenyatta International Airport not to agree with the sale of our airport. I want them to start striking. Let there be no flight coming in. Let there be no flight going out. And let us stand our ground. We cannot allow our airport to be sold unceremoniously or even ceremonious. We will not allow Ruto to mismanage this country and to mismanage the assets of this beloved country. President Ruto, you will be a president for just a few years, and thereafter you shall leave. The moment you leave, there are those who will come in. And therefore, you only have a fiduciary duty, a duty based on trust, to hold, to manage the assets of this country in trust or on behalf of Kenyans. And therefore, we are going to fight and ensure that this airport is not sold to the Adanis. Mr. Adani, be warned and be very much warned. Thank you. To the county government of Nairobi, you did employ some youth in the name of the Green Army. The youth who have been working so spiritedly and religiously to earn a living, these youth have delivered and you haven't paid these youth their salaries from February 2024 to date. This is really absurd. This is really so bad that these youth can't afford to pay rent, can't afford to buy food, can't afford to pay electricity bills, can't afford to pay for other bills, can't even afford to educate their children. And therefore, you need to move with speed. The county government of Nairobi, headed by the governor, you need to move with speed and pay the Green Army their salaries. You only pay them 20,000 Kenya shillings, which is very little. We also demand that you increase their salaries to a minimum of 30,000 Kenya shillings that will enable them to cater for other expenses and manage their future wisely. Move with speed and pay these youth who are working tirelessly for this county.